okay, there's still whole. Oh no. Oh. Oh jeez. Oh Rob. Oh, this is gonna be bad. <gasps> oh. <laughs> All right, good to go. Let's go full speed this time. <laughs> oh, the game does not like what's happening here. Oh. Oh, there's no noise. <laughs> YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Brick Rigs, and today Bob is back, and we're gonna call this Random Bob, because Random Bob is random. So, we're gonna be checking out some random creations once again. You guys have been going nuts over these episodes, because really all it is is I find the most destructive things on the workshop, and I destroy stuff. Uh, you're seeing the Pepe's legal offices here. This is, a uh, by Barbarian, and then we have a cannon over here, or we'll call this a Gatlin cannon, by Overkill. So, we're gonna be checking out some really awesome stuff here today. All the uh, workshop items will be linked down in the description. And if you guys have any suggestions for previous items and future items, uh, maybe face-offs you wanna see, uh, destruction you wanna see, just comment below, let me know, and I'll see if I can get around to it. But yeah. If you're enjoying Brick Rigs on the channel, maybe hit that thumbs up button, it helps out my channel, and let's do this. Alright, so we've got ourselves a little situation here. The city is not happy with Bob, and you're probably, uh, you guys can probably figure out why that is. You know, Pepe's legal team here, uh, they are going to be suing Bob for a lot of money. And by the way, this is a fantastic looking building. You can kind of go in here and... Oh yes, this is a full financial or legal establishment thingy, my Bob. And uh, yeah, you know, Bob's not too happy. So uh, Bob did rent the lot right next door and he did move his new Gatlin cannon over here. Uh, first off, Bob's going to go in and just check into the office and see what's going on. Uh, Totally ignore that that's there. Man, I swear, this thing is so detailed. Like, it would be a shame just to sit here and destroy it first without admiring its beauty just a little bit. What's WC mean? Oh, this is a restroom. Oh, this is actually quite a detailed restroom. And you see the impending doom outside. <laughs> so, there are so many cubicles here. Actually, I did check this out a little bit earlier and just read some of these. Like here, let's go to the top. Some of the cubicle names are just absolutely great. Uh, let's keep going. Top floor here. All right, so some of the cubicle names are absolutely hilarious. Like we have John Rambo here and he's got explosives lined up. Pretty sure three quarters of my audience, if not more, doesn't know who Rambo is. Uh, let's see, let's go down here. Man on a ledge. Uh, what else do we have? A man with no secrets. He's got a clear cubicle. Uh, can I go through some of these? A man with no name. So we got the nameless man here. And are you still reading names? <laughs> uh, let's keep going down. This is a really detailed building. There's bathrooms, there's everything. Uh, this is made out of, I think it's right around 4,400 blocks. Uh, Toronto dump. Okay. <laughs> got a little gold plate there. <laughs> oh, this is great. Uh, Emma Robertson, that sounds familiar. Uh, let's keep going down. Kind of go through some of these that I noticed. Actually, I think we're down to the bottom floor. Yeah, we're pretty much at. I think we've gone through everything here. So yes, folks, we have a Gatlin gun here. Now, I've seen several Gatlin guns on the workshop, but this is probably the biggest one that I saw. So we're going to go in alt mode here. Uh, it's going to start spinning up. Let's give it a second here. All right, I think it's got a targeting system. Oh, this is great. So, uh, oh, it honks too. I forgot about that. <laughs> All right, what are we going to be hitting here? Okay, it goes about that high. All right, let's light the offices up. Here we go. Oh, that is amazing, Han. Oh, oh the camera is completely backwards. Let's go up here. Oh, it's just the gun though. I don't, are we even doing damage, Han? Let's uh, focus fire in one area. Okay, slow it down. Oh, that is too cool. All right, what are we doing to it? Is Pepe's in God mode? Wow. You know, it's almost like the legal team expected this to happen. Hold on, keep firing. Uh, uh, 
come on. All right, you know what? We're gonna open the front doors. Let's go. Uh, uh oh. Uh oh, oh, we're getting through the front doors actually. All right, hold on, slow it down. Oh, we're killing the reception desk here. All right, so we can get through the doors. Uh, we kind of screwed up the sign too, but the walls are thick on this thing. Hold on, let's see if we can we get through the windows. Let's try lighting up the windows here. Let's go for that one. Okay, let's go ahead and go out and check that out. Are we penetrating the window? Are we? Oh, we're starting to go through the office. I think the gun is almost traveling so fast that it's going through it. I think we saw this a bit with the cannon last time. Hold on, let's keep lighting it up here. Uh, <laughs> this is so satisfying to do. That and the noise it makes. This is great. Okay, hold on, let's go examine. Do we do damage to this thing? You know, it's not doing as much damage as I thought it would. And I really think it's a physics thing. I, I don't think the game is able to register and keep up with some of uh, what's happening here. Because, yeah, we're just bouncing off this. Hold on. Let's confirm. Okay, let's go over to Pepe's. Yeah, it's not in God mode. Okay. All right. Cease fire. Cease fire, Bob. Uh-oh. Uh, the cannon stuck. <laughs> no, shut the cannon off, Bob. How do we shut the cannon off? There we go. All right, those are just warning shots. Uh, obviously, Pepe's uh, legal team is in better shape than I thought it would be. All right, so we have the Odin here. Now, it's not showing the author anymore, which I'm kind of curious as to why it's not doing that. Maybe it's by Odin. Maybe that's who it's called. I'll have it down in the description. This has got 236 missiles, 180 medium, 56 small, 5.4K bricks, Oh yeah, this is gonna be awesome. Okay, so let's see. WASD controls. Uh, we're gonna hold S, go into alt mode. Oh yeah, we got this. Two seconds and press A when you're ready to fire. You know what, we can figure this out. Yeah, Bob's not really good with the, uh, he's not good with instructions here. And oh, oh no, no, why? Oh, this is great. Oh, and all right, Bob's gonna go back to the Pepe office. Okay, if this doesn't make you slightly excited, I don't know what does. I mean, look at that. That is an arsenal of missiles. All right, here we go. Let's uh, let's go into alt mode here. Okay, so like I said, hit S. Um, um, maybe I should pay attention to the instructions. Yeah. Okay. All right, going back and reading again. Okay, so apparently we didn't uh, hold S long enough, so we go to alt mode, hold S down for two seconds. It's going to arm the missiles, which I don't know what that means. Okay, I'm assuming the missiles are armed, and then we click A. So let's go A. <gasps> the missiles are moving. Uh-oh. <gasps> oh, no, they're actually taking off. Oh, they're going to do this row by row. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, are they even... Did it just launch them? No, they're going. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, okay, it's full speed this real quick. Oh, no. Oh, the sound doesn't know what to do right now. It's not, I'm not even hearing, uh-oh. I'm not hearing explosions. Oh, uh-oh. No. Oh, this is gonna work. It's gonna continuously get higher and higher with the missiles. It's gonna go all the way up to Pepe building. This is what you get for suing Bob. <laughs> oh. Oh, the game does not like what's happening here. Oh. Oh, there's no noise. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead. I kind of want to do this in full speed. It's taking it out. Oh, no, I'm inside. Oh, it's going floor by floor. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh! <laughs> oh, oh, why am I just now hearing explosions? All right, full speed. No, we just blew it up. It just exploded. What the heck? Uh, how's the Pepe's office? This is a strong building. This is almost too strong. I mean, we kind of destroyed the first couple of floors, but normally those are the entry level employees and all the big wigs are up in the top. Huh. All right, you know, we gotta do that again. All right, we're gonna go for another attempt here. So we're gonna arm the missiles by holding S and they should be armed. All right, let's go again. There we go. All right. Okay, so we, I think we lifted it too far that time and oh. Oh, it's so devastating sounding. And it's weird because you can't even hear the... Uh-oh. You can't hear the missiles. Oh, we're doing it. We are doing it. Oh, Pepe's headquarters or legal team, whatever you want to call this. It, it's going down. Oh, it's one right after another. Hold on, slow this down. All right, all the missiles have been released. 
Oh, those are just going into the, oh, those, you know what, actually, some of them are actually getting, uh, destroyed by the debris flinging back off the tower and hitting the missiles. All right, full speed, I think we just stripped out a couple floors here, hold on, full speed. Oh, Pepe's tower, it's collapsing. All the stuff inside is collapsing. What the, is it, wait, whoa, wait, <laughs> where did those come from? Whoa! That last set of missiles just went off. It was like, oh, it's these little red ones. It just split the building. It went out the back. Uh-oh, Pepe's uh, legal team is going down. Oh, I love building destruction and brick rigs. It doesn't get better than this. All right, here it goes. Oh, it's trying to tip. It's trying. What is it holding up on? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Give it a second. Give it a second. There we go. That teaches you not to mess with Bob. <laughs> oh, oh! I think Rambo's office just exploded. <laughs> wow, that's impressive. That's also using those big pieces again, uh, those uh, scalable bricks in the update. I think this thing, if this would have been made the old way, I'm pretty sure this would have been about 10,000 bricks, but with the big pieces, they can uh, really scale these, uh, or they can really make these buildings big without using as many blocks. All right, so we're ready for our next creation here. We have a NASCAR. This is actually probably one of the best looking NASCARs on the workshop. This is by G. Gurmit. I believe I'm saying that right. It's got kind of an odd name. Uh, yeah, this is based on probably right around the 2005 model, or we'll call it the Gen 4 model. So, yeah, you're probably asking yourself, what are you just going to drive a NASCAR around? Well, we've got another creation back there that we're going to use with this NASCAR, but I do want to drive this real quick. Cause, oh, hear that motor. Man, we need to use this in a challenge. We should have a NASCAR challenge. You know, surprisingly, this feels pretty good. Feels like it's got quite a bit of weight. It's not really wanting to spin the, oh, 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 oh. Okay, a little bit. A little bit of tail spin. Uh, but that's actually not too bad. Uh, you got a little wheel spin, does bounce a bit, but look at the speed on this. Man, we need a NASCAR map in Brick Rigs. You know, maybe we can get one of those little ovals. Uh, I picture this would be a pretty fun little challenge. Uh oh, we just flipped. We just flipped. Oh, and the roll cage didn't do much for Bob. Hey, you can still see Bob, though. Oh, actually, look at that. It's a pretty detailed engine, too. <laughs> oh, it still runs. <laughs> yes, we just had a huge crash, and Bob's still going. So... While the NASCAR is a really, really awesome creation, uh, we're really going to use the car juicer back there. And yes, you heard that right. I said car juicer. This is by Sideways. So I think the idea is to stick your car in here and then juice it because, yeah, that's uh, all the rage now, all the juicing stuff that you hear about. Uh, huh. Those are some really pointy spikes. What are these made out of? I don't recall ever seeing this piece in brick rigs. Uh, is this a solid spike? I don't know. You know what, let's go ahead and stick the NASCAR inside. Oh, actually, you can fit a lot more than I thought you could in here. Hold on, NASCAR comes in? Huh. Okay. You know, I don't feel too safe standing in here. So, we set the NASCAR right here. We could probably fit something even bigger in here. Maybe we'll fit some bobs in here. Uh, let's get into the, uh, the juicer itself. Okay, that's not the juice. Let's go tab. Alright, so the juicer's in God mode. We should probably do this in slow-mo. Let's go slow-mo. Here we go. Ooh, why did that just do that? Oh, Brick Rick slow-mo, what are you doing? All right, let's let that land down. I don't know why some of the wheels started popping up. Uh, slow-mo things. All right, so we're gonna move it like that. Uh, I'm trying to get a view here. Here we go. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh, let's go on on this side. Oh. No! Oh! 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 Whoa! What the heck? And it's all contained, oh, except for the wheel. So it just shot out the side. Oh, let's go full speed. All right. So we're uh, squeezing the NASCAR. So let's just go. Uh. Dude, that is that's creative. And I know what people are probably saying right now. You need to stick Rob in that. No, Rob cannot fit in this. Not unless the lid comes off. Does the lid come off? I don't think it does. No, there's no actuation points on the lid. All right, so Rob's not going in there. So <laughs> Rob is spared today. All right, so we got something here that I think is going to possibly blow up. <laughs> I want to say it does. Uh, it's nuclear liquid fuel cell atoms. 
That is a mouthful there. So this appears to be a trailer that you can haul around in the game, which contains over 10,000 liters of nuclear liquid fuel cell atoms, which, yeah, hold on, let's see, what is this? Oh, how is this 600, almost 700 blocks? Wait a minute, what's in here? Um, oh boy. Okay, question is, do you fit in the, oh you do, okay, let's go, huh? Yeah, this is totally safe. All right, so we got the uh, big nuclear liquid canister in here. Uh, do we want to do this one in slow? Did we do the last one in slow-mo? Actually, I don't really know what's going to happen here. I kind of want to turn God Mode off on the uh, juicer just to see if we get an epic explosion. So let's go God Mode off. All right. Slow-mo. Breathe. Uh-oh. Oh, this is going to be bad. This is going to be bad. Say goodbye to the ju- <laughs> No! Look at the spikes! Look at the spikes! They're all gonna end up everywhere! Uh-oh. That was awesome! I wanna do that again. <laughs> and probably several other times. Like, maybe again and again. Oh, wow! Oh! Wow! The spikes are aggressive. Alright. Well, that kinda worked. I mean, that was cool looking. Uh, no doubt. I kinda wanna do that one more time. Let's do it in full speed. All right, good to go. Let's go full speed this time. <laughs> I love how violent the camera shakes. Wow. This is a fun creation. Man, don't tell them what else we can stick in here. I know somebody's probably like, hey, stick some bobs in there. You know, it's kind of cruel. And I don't know if you can really top the big bomb in here, but yeah, let's do it anyways. All right, so we've captured some desert worms here. They have done some terrible things because desert worms and I need to justify crushing them with spikes. So let's go ahead and go, ooh, oh, hold on, let's go slow-mo. Ooh, wait. Uh, okay, they're still whole. Oh, no. Oh, oh, geez. Oh. 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 <laughs> all right, juicers all the way down. All right, you guys prepared to see what's left over? <laughs> what? <laughs> Were they loaded with pegs? There's nothing left of them. What the heck? Hold on. Can I actually use the wheels? Oh, I can. What's the point of that? <laughs> oh, that is crazy. That is an awesome creation. Sideways is a really, really creative person. And I, I really like that creation. That's awesome. All right, so the next creation we're gonna be checking out is called the Palm. Now you're probably asking yourself, what is this thing? Uh, this is using scalable bricks in the update, but I do believe what this is, it's basically a wall of doom. Uh, it's made out of really heavy material. So let's go over, oh, actually it's halfway in the ground now. Uh, just check this out. Now you can picture what I'm gonna use this for. So we set it up like this and it's a little off weight. It goes all the way down and boom. That has some serious weight to it. Now it is in God mode. I'll turn God mode off here in a second. But this is like a huge concrete slab that it's gonna pretty much crush or slap or do something to whatever I crush it with. Uh, I've got just the perfect thing to crush it with, though. Let's go get our boy. It's your boy, Ragdoll Rob. Now, Ragdoll Rob, he's a fantastic... He's a good sport, actually. We'll call him that. He's a fantastic person. He loves to just get out here and test some brick rigs things with us. So, Ragdoll Rob is going to meet the big uh, concrete slab thingy. So, let's go ahead and go... Let's go ahead and stand you up right here. Okay, Rob, you good to go? Yeah, Rob, see, he's happy. He loves doing this. Uh, no Robs were... Well, actually, no, I can't say Robs weren't harmed during this, but let's see if this works. So if I place this about right, probably here. Okay, slow it down. <laughs> oh, this is going to be terrible. All right, Rob, you just hang in there. We're going to do this full speed to see what happens. You just see Bob hanging out on top. He's uh, He's having a good day. And say goodbye to Rob. Oh, no. Oh, Rob. Oh, this is gonna be bad. Oh. Oh, no. 
Uh oh. Uh oh. Wait. That actually worked. That just crushed Rob. Uh, some of Rob just spilt out the top. Okay, Han. Let's see what Rob looks like after the, uh, after his makeover. <laughs> wait, 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 what? Oh, Rob went spilling through the bottom of the map. <laughs> I'm about to say Rob's made out of more blocks than that. Huh. I got a better test with this. Hold on, let's, uh, let's set this back up. All right, here we go. Once again, this one's looking good. Oh, this one's looking beautiful. Is it good? Okay, it's probably gonna flip here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. No! Oh, there it goes! Oh, he just slammed into Rob! Oh, 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 Rob. Oh, oh, that's wrong. Oh. <laughs> Rob's feet are still there. Um, well, Rob ended up. Yeah, he got a little flung there. He's okay, though. Alright, so we got one more test with this thing. I'm gonna turn off God Mode because you do not realize how many bricks are actually in this slab. And once this thing breaks apart, if you recall a couple episodes ago we had the Judgment Day. How it just blew up into a million pieces even though it looked like one solid piece. That's what this does. Alright, here we go. God Mode is officially off. Alright. Say goodbye to Rob, except for this might be, this is going to get messy because I don't know what's going to exactly happen. I'm pretty sure this thing's going to explode. Uh, there goes Rob and, oh, wait, it held together this time. Oh, wow. Okay, Rob went, oh, that's, that's wrong. Huh. Well, that didn't explode that time. Oh, here's what's, oh. The rest of Rob just flew through the map. All right, let's get back over to this. Uh, let's see if we can get this thing to break apart. Uh, let's kind of spawn it from up here. God mode is off. All right, here we go. Oh, oh, here we go. Oh! See? Look how many pieces that was. That's several slabs. Uh-oh. Oh, this thing's freaking out. Is that more effective from dropping it up here? Does this work better? Hold on. Is this like a, does this slap down harder? No, it doesn't really seem to have that. Wait, wait, it does. All right, we got to use this on a building. All right, so we have a very awesome quickie mart that we are going to crush with the big slab of doom. And check this out. Yesterday's food at tomorrow's prices. This is so detailed. This is actually based off of the, uh, the actual set, the Lego set for this. Really, really awesome looking good. Just gotta admire it real quick before we destroy it because, I mean, come on. The detail here, here's the counter. Uh-oh, I seem to be stuck. Uh, squeeze your butt through there. Okay, hold on, let's just go this way. Yep. <laughs> what the heck? Man, did, uh, did Bob put on some weight? Here we go. Alright, we can go over here. We got some magazines. I think this is a... Oh, these are the arcade machines. There's the Slurpees. Oh, yeah. That's a really cool model. And even just the outside. I kind of would like to actually have this real model. I think this would be really cool to have, uh, Lego form wise. Yeah, that's awesome. All right, so uh, we're gonna get the slab of doom. We're gonna drop it from the sky, and it's gonna slam down on this. And then we'll see what happens. If it still reacts the same way, this could be amazing. All right, here we go. Slab of doom versus the quickie mart here. All right. Oh boy. Oh, this up. Oh, is that good? That's good. Ooh, oh, no, no, we just hit the front of it. Whoa, that does an incredible amount of damage. This is like the new destruction thing in Brick Rigs. Hold on, we gotta reset that. Wait, what the heck? Where did Bob go here? How did Bob make it up? Oh, never mind, I'm not gonna ask questions. All right, let's reset the quickie mark. Let's go back into Bob here. All right, we should be good to go. All right, we're going to attempt this again, and we're going to be a little bit closer. So let's go uh, slow it down. That way I can get down here. All right, say goodbye to the quick E Mart. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oop. And then it's going to do its power bomb here. Ready? Power bomb. Ooh. <laughs> uh oh. 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 That does such a good job. I mean... The, uh, the game can really not handle this because half the stuff shoots up through the top, but it 
Yeah, it pushes stuff under the map. Actually, this gives you a really good view showing you how it crushed it. That is amazing. Yeah, that slab, that is something. But anyways, I think it's going to wrap it up for this episode of Brick Rigs. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. If you want to see me like go back and use any of these creations, say uh, say I missed something, something that you really want to see me do, uh, comment below. I might take some of these back out and attempt other things. I've been noticing a lot of uh, comments like that where it's like, hey, you should have did this, and I'm not opposed to going back and doing some of that. So if you have any suggestions, comment below. But hope you guys have a great day, and we will see you guys next time in Brick Rigs. Thank you.